Yard. It's been a staple in Plainview for more than half a century. So when news that the Regal Kosher Deli was going to close, the community was devastated. Now we have some good news. It's actually staying open. News 12's Andrew Anger is at Regal with the rest of the story now. Andrew. Well, it is almost inconceivable how many knishes, pastrami sandwiches, and other kosher delicacies have been served here at the Regal over its lifetime. But when news that it was going to close came out, the community was understandably upset. But now a new owner has stepped forward to help keep the Regal alive. It was kind of time to in my eyes to maybe say goodbye, like go out like on a high. Talking about closing the business that she grew up in, that her father started more than five decades ago, was not an easy one for Regal Deli owner Sherry Banks. But the economy, food costs, and labor issues, she says, convinced her to look at closing. But then she says her head chef for 32 years, William Diaz, said he'd buy the business, keeping this kosher delicatessen open. All the, my customers coming in and they see me, they know me, you know, I, I feel happy. But all the customers say, you know, the business continue hoping. The Regal Deli was a popular one over its 56 years in Plainview. And before some customers heard the news, they rushed here today to get one last plate of classic kosher deli cooking. Too many places are going out of business. This could have been a sad story. Yeah, no, it could have been horrible. It would have been probably been an empty building for, for years. We don't need any more empty buildings. Ken James, a self-described deli aficionado, drove 40 miles to try the Regal and is happy it will survive. A lot of them are closing, not many left. So to me, it's a thrill that they're here and I have a place to come. Special touches at the Regal, like its rubber plant that hangs over diner's head, will not be changing. Nor Diaz says will any of the recipes. Sherry Banks says she's passing the torch over to the most qualified person. He's been here since he's 16 years old. He knows every recipe more than I do. <laughs> if I didn't have him, I couldn't be in business, put it that way. Now Banks says all 10 employees that are currently working here will make the transition over to the new owner and that she says that she'll help Diaz with the transition going forward to make sure that all customers continue here at the Regal to remain happy. We're in Plainview, Andrew Anger, News 12, Long Island.